Robot vacuums and mops are beginning to take over homes everywhere, and why not? The DreamBot D10 Plus is a two-in-one robot vacuum and mop that's mid-range in price and is the quietest auto empty base that I have tested to date. It leaves some of the most satisfying carpet lines, and it's one that I think you are going to like. The DreamBot D10 Plus has a 4,000 PA suction power, which is really high. The higher the number, the better the suction power. This is a device that I have really enjoyed using. So when you first get it out of the box, you'll get it all set up, you'll get it connected to your phone. First things first, the robot needs to do some test runs of your house to really get a layout and get an understanding of what it's working with. So after those first few mapping runs, the LiDAR technology in this was really fast. It's done a really nice job. I think it had a pretty solid map of my house just after a run, which usually for the robot vacuums that I have tested, it takes a couple different runs. So I really like seeing that immediately off the bat. Once the map is made, you're able to tell it um, it can specifically clean certain rooms or you can have it clean everything. Usually with robot vacuums, I'm not impressed enough to have them clean the carpet in my house, but the DreamBot D10 Plus leaves some of the most satisfying carpet lines and it does a really good job picking up that ingrained uh, pet hair and just dirt. So this has been given full run of my house. I've been very impressed with its suction power. For the most part throughout my house, I have a lot of tile. The carpet's in the bedroom, the tile is everywhere else in the house. And it did have a little bit of a hard time picking up when there's a lot of dirt. So if I didn't run it for a couple days, I'll be honest, I've got a lot of dog hair and cat hair. So sometimes it had a harder time picking things up, but if this is a device that you can run every single day, maybe every other day, or maybe you just don't have as much dirt as I do, this will be fantastic. One thing I do want to mention for the vacuuming is for someone like me who has really long hair, the rollers in the DreamBot D10 Plus did get tangled up quite a few times. Um, my hair, the dog hair, uh, they get in there. So that is something that you wanna keep in mind. I will say regular vacuums, I have had that issue as well. So if you're someone who doesn't have long hair like this or if you're just used to it, that may not be a deal breaker for you, uh, but it could be. Moving on to the mopping for the two-in-one device, you just take the bottom piece out and swap it in. You fill it up with water. The tank is relatively small. Uh, so if you were wanting to clean a lot of rooms, you would have to refill it several times. On the insert itself, it tells you don't use cleaning detergent. Um, and that's kind of a deal breaker for me. My house is dirty enough that I don't just want a mop pushing around dirty water across my floor. It's going to be streaky. It's not going to clean anything. So the mopping feature on this was not for me. I, I used it to test it. I wasn't impressed. Uh, I, I won't be using it. But in its defense, I've found very few robot mops that I do like and that I do trust. So this isn't one of them. I would not buy this for the mopping feature. I would look elsewhere. After the DreamBot D10 Plus does its cleaning and vacuuming around your house, it will take itself back to its auto empty base and it will empty itself. And this thing is so quiet. I cannot believe how quietly it is able to self empty. And the tank, the amount of hair that this is able to hold is very impressive. I'm I'm a big fan of this vacuum and the auto empty base. I think it makes it completely worth it. Start charging. Start auto empty. Another favorite feature of the DreamBot D10 Plus is its battery. It can clean my entire house on a single charge. DreamBot says that the D10 Plus can vacuum up to 3,000 square feet on the single charge. My house isn't anywhere that big, so it does a phenomenal job. So if you're someone who has a larger home and you get annoyed with the job being broken up over and over, the DreamBot D10 Plus will be for you. 
The bottom line is the DreamBot D10 Plus is a quality vacuum that is mid-range in price. And I think the auto empty base and its battery life and its LiDAR technology makes it worth it. I would not buy this if you're looking to utilize the mop feature. I don't think it's worth it. I think there are better mopping robots that are on the market. So just keep that in mind. But if you're looking for a vacuum, it's really easy just to use this as a vacuum. And I think it's worth it. As always down below, we have a link to the DreamBot D10 Plus along with a written review. Be sure to check both of these out. If there is a robot vacuum or mop that you want to see, let us know in the comments. We'd love to test it out. We'd love to let you know what we think. As always, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to stick with ZDNet.